Hi everyone, my name is Jamie and I work with our technical support team here at Medtronic. Did you know that making some changes to the way that you bolus can actually improve your experience on an insulin pump? As a reminder, a bolus is insulin that you give before meals and to correct for high blood sugar. So let's talk about some things that you can actually try. First, did you know that when you give the bolus actually has a big impact on your levels? You should always bolus before every meal and snack and bolusing about five to 15 minutes before you actually start eating is the best practice. Because if you wait too long to bolus, it actually can cause your blood sugar levels to go high. Second, if you're like me and you have trouble remembering to actually bolus, you can actually use the missed meal bolus reminder. With the reminder turned on, you get an alert if your bolus isn't delivered during a specific time frame that you set. So those that use this alert, they will um, set reminders around their kind of typical meal times. So for example, somebody that always eats breakfast between 7 and 8 a.m., they would set that alarm for that time period. And here's how you actually set that reminder. So you're gonna go into your pump by pressing the circle on the front of your pump and select options. And then next you're gonna choose reminders. And then we're gonna go down to where it says missed meal bolus. We're gonna select add new. And then once we're on that screen, we're gonna go ahead and customize the start time and the end time. And then the most important thing we wanna do is make sure we save it when we're done. And then third, accurate carb counting is a super important part of bolusing. If you're struggling to count carbs, there are some really neat tools that actually can help you with that. Uh, a lot of people download an app like um, MyFitnessPal or Calorie King that actually help them estimate the amount of carbs that are in a meal. You can also kind of keep a list or a note on your phone that contains the amount of carbs in some of your favorite meals. That way you don't have to keep um, having to calculate it every time you eat it. It's already pre-saved in your phone for you. And then finally, take advantage of the system's ability to help you calculate the insulin amount that you actually do need to bolus. So there's a feature on your pump when you're using SmartGuard Auto Mode where you simply enter the carbs you plan to eat and provide it your blood glucose reading at the time and the system calculates your optimal dose for the meal. Does it for you. So if you're using manual mode, the bolus wizard feature, it'll do the same guidance. It'll provide the same guidance for you if you're not using auto mode and you're using manual mode. Thanks for watching guys.